All right, let's go ahead and convert 6.1 kilometers cubed into millimeters cubed. Okay, so the, the two conversions that we'll need to know are kilo and milli. Kilo is equal to 10 to the third, and milli is equal to 10 to the negative third. All right, so we're gonna go through and do this, and I go t into uh, a little more depth in the, the actual lecture about this material, so I'm, I'm not going to go into a lot of depth right now, but what I am gonna do is show you the shortcuts, so we make sure, remember, we got 6.1 kilo, we're gonna replace with 10 to the third, so we're gonna essentially place that with 10 to the third, but it's cubed, right? So it's 10 to the third cubed meters cubed. So we got 6.1 times 10 to the third cubed meters cubed. Now we set this up, if this is meters, we put meters here and we're turning it into millimeters, but not just any kind of millimeters, it's millimeters cubed. Milli is equal to 10 to the negative third. And again, this is cubed, so we're gonna cube this, cube that, and cube the milli. All right, so now we've got our problem all set up because we know that uh, meters cubed are gonna cancel and we're left with the units of millimeters cubed, and that's where we wanna be. So let's go ahead and put that down here. I'm gonna rewrite it so it's all nice and clean. We have 6.1 times 10 to the third cubed, all divided by 10 to the negative third cubed. Okay, so um, there's a few different ways you can think about this. 10 to the third cubed is 10 to the third times 10 to the third times 10 to the third. And that would be 10 to the three plus three plus three or 10 to the nine. Another really quick way to do it is just multiply this times that, and that will give you the appropriate exponent. So now let's go ahead and, and reduce it even further. We got 6.1 times 10 to the nine, divided by 10 to the negative nine. And anytime we divide, we subtract. So that gives us 6.1 times 10 to the nine minus a negative nine. Subtracting a negative number is the same thing as adding a positive. So now we got 6.1 times 10 to the nine plus nine, or 18, and again, our unit was millimeters cubed. So I hope that helps. Have a good day.